Can you ask me straight off the bat, is, is this your first cup of coffee? It is. It is. Yes. Another one. I'm having way too much fun. How did you admit it? Um, yeah, no, I just did it. Oh. Yeah, it's my first one. In fact, it's all of ours. So, some good energy. We're having a great time. What was the appeal initially of starring in this? I got the script. My agent was, you gotta read this. It's right up your alley. Um, and he was right. It, it was this beautiful combination of um, passions in my life. I mean, it was the vampire genre, like, you know, it's just been something that has kind of been in my life ever since I was young. I was obsessed with vampires as a kid. Um, and uh, the athletic aspect to the role that, that you know, the athleticism it required. Um, I come from a really athletic background. So that aspect of it is like if I get to act and be at, like, do my thing like physically like that, um, it's kind of a double whammy for me. And you know we didn't see this much in uh, the footage we showed, but that Vanessa's uh, she's a mom and she has a daughter and I have a daughter. Um, so you know she wakes up from being in a coma for three years and she finds the world's gone to shit and there are all these people who want her for different reasons um, but all she cares about is where's her daughter what's happened to her daughter um, could she have survived uh, she has to find out and so that becomes her main mission is um, finding her daughter so that's why you're so, referred to Ripley yeah okay yeah. <laughs> Um, and I, I loved that. I just it was something I could really resonate with and get passionate about. And I thought I just thought it was a really cool journey that she goes on and this self discovery. Uh, I loved that it happens with the audience. Um, that the audience and her are discovering it at the same time. I, I really loved that as well. Why have you had a lifelong love of vampires? What is it do you think? What? I mean, it's it's a great question, I think, and I keep asking myself that, and so do other people. Um, I think that there's the the best answer at this time that I can come up with is, um, you know, I this idea of being immortal, right? Of conquering death. I mean, we're all gonna die, and I think um, the idea of immortality and. Um, Vampire stories in the past, you know, have always been so romantic and tied into like true love and then loving somebody so much that you want to spend eternity with them. I think innately um, is kind of in our hearts as humans um, that we all want those things. And so I think that's why the genre does so well. And I think that's why, you know, as, as a kid, I thought it was really awesome. And you, and you could fly. I mean, <laughs> so, you're, so, you're, so you're more of the Bram Stoker Dracula yeah. rather than Blade yeah. and the Lost Boys kind of. <laughs> no, 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 no. I love the Lost Boys. Love the Lost Boys. Lost Boys, even Fright Night. Okay. And Anne Rice, I was obsessed with Anne Rice. Growing up, yeah. Would recite interview with the vampire in the graveyard with my boyfriend. We so were cool. Dude, we did. We I totally did that. I'm guessing a lot of I'm guessing a lot of black in your outfits when you were. Yes, very curly Claudia hair. <laughs> <laughs> so, in the storyline that you have going on with, yeah, with the first season, is there going to be the concern that your daughter also has her and therefore she might be in danger, or is that not true? Um, that's a great question. I don't think I can answer that. Oh, okay. <laughs> Sorry, that's a great question. Hopefully lots of people will wonder. Is this a pretty action-heavy role for you, or is it? Talk about that. It was oh, great. I mean, it was so great um, because I've I've done a succession of um, you know physical roles from Tekken to True Blood. Um, 
it's part of my job to stay, you know, fit and um, to get in the gym and do my thing. Um, so boxing and uh, MMA and um, one of the things that was really fun for me is that this time I, I focused on, um, uh, you know, bodybuilding, more bodybuilding moves, like deadlifts and just getting stronger and having more muscle mass, which was really fun. Um, so, yeah, I love that. And like I said, um, being able to use that athletic part of me and those two passions at the same time is like the perfect show. <laughs> it's great. Yeah. Coming into the role, what did you think of the reimagination of Van Helsing as a female instead of the typical male that we usually see? 